Assalamu alaikum ladies, how's it going? Um, today I am doing a cosmetics haul um, Yeah, cosmetics fairy haul um, Kind of went a bit crazy, bought loads of stuff um, Let's just go through it together Actually I went to body care as well today and bought loads of stuff So I'll show you kind of like all the stuff that I use um, And yeah, fun times ahead Right, let's get started The first thing that I got I've opened these already because I couldn't like control myself. Is this Wink Wink Compact? Most of this stuff is eyeshadows. Most of it. I don't wear that much lipstick, as you can tell. Um, I wear more eyeshadows and bronzers because I like a good bronzer. Right, check it out. It comes with a really nice palette, and then you open it up, and then again, nothing will ever open. There you go. Look at the colours. I don't know if you can even see them. See, I'm doing it in front of the mirror, I mean in front of the window today, so hopefully you can see properly. But there's some really nice colours in there. Especially for like parties and, you know, like Christmas is coming up, so there's going to be a few parties, I suppose. That would be quite nice. I got, I got this. Now the thing is, this is, I really wanted something like this. It's really cheap, colour cosmetics. This is all from Cosmetics Fairy, which is like a... A discounted makeup store I think that's what I'm gonna call it um, I'll link it in the description below so you can like, go on it and check all stuff out really cheap stuff um, but it comes well packeted um, I think this is just some of the knockoff stuff the stuff that didn't sell and they've just you know they've cheapened it or whatever so so there's this and I think to be honest the reason I got it was for the purple and the pink shade Oh, and the lime green, that looks nice. They're really pretty colours. Really strong, bold colours. And there's that. This stuff is really good. It's NYC. And it's, it's a glitter powder. I'm wearing the brown one at the minute. Oh my god, don't look at my eyebrows. But, um... I think it's come off really nice. It, they, it looks really good. Hold on. I'll give you like a swatch, hold on. if you can see that of that. You can see like the glitter. Really shimmery, really pretty. And it kind of like, it stays on. It doesn't like, you know, it didn't like fade off too fast. Which is good. And this one is like an iridescent kind of colour. Go through this one. It looks white, but in like the light, you can kind of like, you can just catch the kind of like rainbow, purpley shadow to it. It looks good on colours. I wouldn't just put it on just like that because I don't think it looks that great. But if you put it on colours, it looks a lot better. Um, more eyeshadows. This was really cool. Like, uh, and this bit, flip that bit up, if I can, I'll attempt to, it's my nails you know guys, I can't do anything because of my massive nails, there, that's a really nice palette too, I thought I'd go for different colours I don't usually go for, normally I'd go for the, the nudes, the kind of bronze, brown, etc, got this one's in Constance Carol, a nice green, um, a kind of like, I'm going to say moss green and um, beige, beige cream and then I thought, okay, well let's try some lipsticks obviously I'm only, I can only wear really like dark colours I can't wear pink, I look ridiculous I can't wear fuchsia, I bought fuchsia so I can't wear it, it just, it doesn't look right on me I think you just kind of know what colours look right on you this is L'Oreal Paris Number 832 and it's called Unending Amber. See it? And this is the colour. A really nice colour. Really smooth. Very velvety. And it kind of slots together. That's pretty cool. Um, the second colour that I got was 
Mahogany by Constance Carroll. This is really good. This is really nice. As you can tell, I've already used it, which is pretty gross. But um, yeah, it's it's a really nice color. I got this now. I've not used this yet because I'm a little bit weary. It's a glitz eye dust. Now this could go really well, or it could go horribly wrong, um, because I can only imagine that it's gonna it's gonna look really strong. Like it's such a strong colour. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm I'm here I'm neither here nor there. Maybe I'll do like a tutorial on on eye dust. You know, and, and see what it looks like. I'll try it. I also got see I got this now. This was just like a waste um of money. Having said that I spent like what about ninety pence on it. It's Maybelline, Maybelline New York, Shine Sensational Lip Gloss. It's so plain. It's in cocoa. Cocoa fever. 50. It's literally, it's not even there. <laughs> it's, it's so like, it's so sheer. It, you may as well just wear bloody lip balm. Because, I suppose, see what I mean? Like, I've just rubbed it in and you can't even like see it's there. It's a waste of money, if you ask me. This was a lot. This is really good. Um, this is the L'Oreal Paris Glam Shine 6 Hour Gloss Brilliance in, what colour is it now? It is Plum Addiction. This is really nice. Really nice. Um, it's very sticky, so obviously, you know, it's, it's pretty sticky, so just kind of like keep that in mind. Um, but it's really nice, like, I, it stays on. You know, it looks great, it smells like phenomenal. Mmm, yeah, it smells awesome. And um, yeah, it's pretty cool. I used this today. Um, this is actually really good. Like, I don't know, my eyelashes, they're not that long. They, they're like just your run of the mill. I know you get girls who have like enormous eyelashes, but this is just like, normal but um this was pretty good like it lengthened them a fair bit i'll show you the stick for it can you see that or what of that so obviously one bit is shorter one bit is longer it's really good um so this was all this stuff oh and barry m blusher see i've st i've not used this either i'm pretty wary because i have really fat cheeks so if I use this, it's it just going to extenuate them more. I know they say put it on the upper, but my cheeks are normally a little bit pink anyway. I'm not sure if I'm going to use it. This could have been a waste of money as well. But um, you never know. You never know. So my body care today. And uh, you know how I kept saying, oh, um, this sun-kissed palette, um, oops, upside down, is like the bomb. It's just amazing. Right, I saw another one just like it today, uh, £1.49, same, exact same one, but I thought, to be honest, if you look carefully, I've not actually used all the colours, I've only used one, two, the two of the colours, so, today when I went, I bought, I bought a brush set, literally, I only wanted it that brush I know I have a brush set already but I thought this is gonna be good for my eyebrows because I can't just use a pencil I use the pencil today and just if they look very messy so there's that and um, yeah I got this this is the equivalent of this but because I'm not using all of these I will probably just be using these colors but this looks like so much fun it's got so many nice colors in it Again, this was like something stupid, like one pound forty-nine. Cheap, cheap, cheap. And guess what? Kept seeing um, Urban Decay Electric Palette. Kept seeing it everywhere, and thinking, "Oh, I really want it." Saw the price, thirty-eight quid. That's not happening. So I'm into body care. Ta-da! They have their own electric palette. Right now, I'm going to open this, and you're going to be shocked. 
at how bloody similar it is. Yes, you're not paying £38 and yes, you're probably, it may not be like, you know, oh my god, you can see my net. Um, it may not be the best. I don't know if you can actually, oh, maybe pull it away a bit. You're not getting the best colours, you can't see. Oh, there you go. Right, now you can see. Um, so you got your yellow, your orange, your peach, your copper, your fuchsia, your plum, forest green, teal, turk, violet, blue, and violet, violet. Um, I'm really excited about using this, especially for Halloween tutorials. I was thinking of doing a few. Um, let me know if you want me to do some. I was thinking of doing like a leopard. Um a leopard print kind of thing and a butterfly one and a cat um all hijab friendly so it's not going to be over the top you're not going to look like a you know you're not going to look silly you don't want that um but yeah let me know and this is great this was £2.50 £2.50 and I've got literally the same colours now they may not be the best but having said that I think I did pretty well I was like overly excited in the shop today. Um, and then, okay, this is the last thing. I know I've been talking for ages. But I got this bronzo bronzong, bronzing highlighter. I can't even see. That's what it says. That doesn't, no, yeah, might be able to see it there. Um, let's open this because I don't know what I've bought. I don't know what it's like. I don't know what it's going to look like or feel like or the texture of it. It looks liquidy. Now, I mean, if it is, that's no big deal. I mean, I can always just kind of like blend it out. But, um, I can never open stuff, ever. And I don't want to, like, start gnawing at it like an animal. Because nobody wants to see that nastiness. Oh, there you go, okay. Thank you, extremely long nails. Yeah, it is, it's a, it's like a paintbrush. Like, I'm going to try some in my hand. That's not bad. Oh, that's actually... That's actually really nice. Why can't you see anything? Well, it's there. This was like £2. I'm going to try it. I don't want to try it right now because I'm a little scared. Um, that may look stupid, so I don't want to do that. Um, but I will try it, and I will let you know how it goes. Um, but yeah, that's that's basically the haul for today. I've not, I've not gone crazy. I did do, I did like a bit of a Primark haul last week, but didn't video it. Um, I'm just gonna like stick to makeup for the time being. Going to fashion later. Um, if you don't want to see it. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for um, looking at what I bought. I hope you found some inspiration and go to your local um, body care store and read it. Um, but yeah, thank you so much. I will see you soon. Bye, ladies.